All right, now recently Meta has released some brand new features on WhatsApp. In this video, let's take a look at them. Now, some features are already available on the stable version of WhatsApp and some of them are currently available only on the beta version. Now on this phone, I have got the stable version and on this device here, I have got the beta version of WhatsApp. Now let's look at the first one. Let me open the application on both the phones here. You see at the bottom right here, I got the Meta AI icon. And for some reason, I haven't got the Meta AI yet on the beta version of WhatsApp. That's kind of funny because on the stable version, I already have Meta AI right here. So this depends. You may or may not have received this feature. Now let me just tap on this icon here. You see it says ask Meta AI anything. Let me tap on the text box here. See it says get answers to any questions, express yourself, personal messages stay private. It says Meta may use your AI messages to improve AI quality. Personal messages are never sent to Meta can't be read and remain end-to-end -end encrypted. Now this is Meta AI for you. Let me tap on continue. Now right here we can chat with Meta AI. Let's ask a quick question here. Let's ask who is the Prime Minister of Australia. I'll tap on send. You see I'm getting a response here. You see right here we have the answers. Now after we get the answer you see we can tap on a Google search results here or we can directly go to Wikipedia from where this answer has been fetched. Let me tap on this. You see it's taking me to Wikipedia and I can tap on a Google icon here. This will take me to Google search results. So that is how this works. Now let me ask another question. How much is five divided by five? I'll send. You see, we have the answer right here. In other words, five divided by five equals to one. We have got the answer in both number as well as in words. Create an image of Batman riding a horse. You see, Meta AI can create the images as well. We have got Batman riding a horse. This is a beautiful image which has been created by the AI. This looks just fantastic. Now, this is how Meta AI works on WhatsApp. Let me know whether you have got this feature or not. Drop a comment. All right, now the next feature which is currently available on a WhatsApp beta version is the favorites option. You see on the top, uh, on the stable version, we have got all 100 and groups. And here on the beta version, you can see we have got all 100 favorites and groups. Now I can tap on favorites to see all my my favorite contacts. If you want to add a favorite contact, all you need to do is just press and hold on a particular chat and tap on this three dot button. And here we get an option add to favorites. We can tap on this to add this chat to favorites. And here, if we do the same thing, we do not get that option here. As you can see, there is no option to uh, add the contact to favorites. Let me do this again. You see, we've got all other option, but favorites. So now we can easily check the favorite contacts right here by tapping on this tab. We don't really have to search the favorite contacts or favorite chats inside the uh, chat list here. Next, we now have quick reply to video messages. Now you see I have sent a video message to this phone from this particular contact number. Now here you see I have got an option to instantly reply to this video message. All I can do is just tap on this and it will immediately start creating a video message and I can tap on send. So now we have an all new option to instantly reply to a video message through a video message. Now let's say I have sent a message to somebody uh, and I want to delete it. All I do is I press and hold on that message and tap on delete. Now what happens is it prompts me to delete for everyone or delete for me or cancel. Now let's say by mistake I tap on delete for me then there is no way to delete that message for everyone because that message will disappear. But now with this all new update when we tap on delete for me by mistake uh, you see we get message deleted for me undo option. I can just tap on that and that message will come back so that I can again press and hold on that message and delete it for everyone. Now you see this message has come back. I can press and hold on this, tap on delete and tap on delete for everyone. If you tap on delete it for me, then it will show you undo option. Tap on that, that message will come back. Now that is a very useful feature which has been added. Now this may be available on the stable version as well. You can go ahead and check it out. Next, Meta is also adding a brand new sticker pack uh, called Lotte stickers. I'm not very sure if I'm pronouncing it right. Uh, it's called Lotte stickers. Now these stickers will enhance our sticker experience. And these are the official sticker packs created with the Lotte framework. These stickers offer better animations and transitions and they are pleasing to the eyes. So these are some new sticker packs which uh, Meta has introduced. Now to access this, all you need to do is tap on the text box and tap on the smiley button here. Now this is where we get sticker option. Just tap on a plus button here. Now you'll be able to see some brand new stickers from Buck and these offer some better animations whenever you send them. Now I have already uh, added these stickers. You see now let me just send some of the stickers here. You see these have some better animations and transitions and they are looking a little better than the normal stickers that we send. So that's a new feature which has been added now. 
Next, let's say if you're creating an audio message, now we will be able to pause the message while sending it and replay it to listen to what we have spoken. Now to send an audio message, I can just press and hold on this icon and uh, lock it. Now it is recording my audio. Now while recording the audio, what I can do is I can just tap on this pause button. Now you see the audio has stopped. Now I can play the audio. Hold on this icon and uh, lock it. Now it is recording my audio. Now while recording the audio, what I can do is I can just tap on this pause. You see, I could listen to what I have spoken and then resume recording. I can tap on this record icon again and it will resume recording the same audio. And after it is done, we can tap on send. Now inside a group chat on WhatsApp, we will now be able to add events. All we need to do is just tap on this attach icon here. Now here you see we have got an all new icon for events. I can tap on this and I can create an event, select the date and time and then tap on send. Now that event will be recorded right here. You see the event has been sent. I can tap on edit event if I want to further edit this event. And we also have an option to cancel event. I can tap on cancel and tap on yes and continue. Now you see it says you cancelled tea time and I can just tap on this to see the event if I want. Now these are some brand new features which we have received for the WhatsApp application. You let me know whether you are enjoying all these features. Have you already got it? Drop a comment and let me know. Currently I am using the beta version on my primary device. As you can see the latest version number is 2.24.14.10. Some of the features are already available on the beta version and some are available on the stable version as well. So you may or may not get all these features so do check and drop a comment in the comment section that is all i want to share with you guys and i'm also leaving a link for this particular wallpaper every video i post will have a brand new wallpaper if you're interested you can go ahead and download them for this video i have left a link for this wallpaper so go ahead and check it out and if you like it you can download it and apply it on your home screen that's about it uh, i hope you have already subscribed to the channel if you haven't done it already go ahead hit the subscribe button and give this video a like if you find this useful thanks for watching my name is salian signing off Cheers, bye-bye.